What's good, y'all boys? I'm back here with another vid. I'm going to do a little reaction video. And like I said, my equipment all ain't came in yet. But when it do, then I can do the reaction videos how they supposed to be done. Uh, but today I'm going to be reacting to why you need to have a bulletproof mindset when it comes to life in general. And I'm gonna tag the videos that I'm watching in the clip while it's playing. But while I'm reacting, we're gonna react. Nobody cares, you know? At the end of the day, nobody cares. What we're going through, how your body feels, nobody cares. We gotta, we gotta do our job. Life, life is tough sometimes and it's not fair. And it doesn't care sometimes. Um, but you're gonna hold true to what you believe and you're gonna hold true to who you are and you're gonna be that person whether it's easier or it's not. Is it fair? No. Um, because I want to you know, have emotions about things. I want to think about things as a human. Now, he was exactly right in that clip. As a man, nobody cares about what you're going through, how you feel, none of that shit. Nobody cares that you had a bad week. Nobody cares that you had a bad day. Nobody cares your relationship just ended. Nobody cares that you don't have no money in the bank. Nobody cares you can't find a job. Nobody cares about none of that shit. Nobody cares your dog died. Nobody cares your mom died, your dad died. Nobody gives a fuck. That's what you signed up for when you was born. I'm gonna do my initial feedback on every video that I react to at the end, but we're gonna get straight into the next one. If I disappear, like, who cares? Nobody cares, man. Seriously. Yo, and that's okay. That, that's life. That's life. Straight to the next one. <laughs> this is the truest one right here. Outside of the first one, nobody cares. Because as a man, you could be struggling to the highest degree and nobody will ever know. I could be struggling right now. You would never know. You could be struggling right now. I would never know. Because as men, you could talk about your problems, but a lot of times you just keep it to yourself. And even if you do talk about it, you don't give too much information because you can't really trust nobody. And then they, a lot of people could say, well, that's your fault. You can't trust nobody. But then it's like people around you prove why you can't trust them. Who do you call when you are at your lowest? Who is that one person? Nobody. I'm a man. No one cares. Not a single soul. Nobody. No one. Because I'm all alone. I think I speak for um, a lot of people. Nobody, I'm a guy, nobody gives a shit. Speaking for the guys when I say this, literally no one. <laughs> Do y'all call someone? Nobody, just nobody. No, no one's talking to me, so no one. You guys, no one. No one. I'm a man. No one cares. No one, not a single fucking person. I wouldn't call anyone. I wouldn't turn to a single person on this earth because they don't care. Now y'all just seen all them videos. As a man, if that doesn't light a spark to make you want to become something, to just make you want to get out and say, fuck all the opinions. You looking at this video, whatever you want to do, go do it. Start it today. It don't matter if you invest all your money into it. Because guess what? You go broke, nobody gives a fuck. You get rich, they give a fuck. But that's when, when you get rich, you can't give a fuck about them. You can't give a fuck about them. They don't give a fuck about you. We seen it in the clips. All the men saying, nobody gives a fuck. Nobody cares about them. So it's like, when you make it to where you want to be, why would you give a fuck about them? Why would you give a fuck about them? People care when it's too late. And that's the problem with this society. People care when it's way too late. When Okay, now I realize people don't, don't give a fuck. I'm finna grind for this two years. Then you make it, then everybody give a fuck. Oh, I always believed it. No, the fuck you didn't. No, the fuck you did not. So I'm gonna keep your ass over there with everybody else. 
And that's how it's got to be. As a man, you need to have a bulletproof mindset. A bulletproof mindset. Nothing should affect you. Because this is why men is killing themselves. Because they feel like, I don't have nobody to go to. I don't have nobody who I can vent. Even if you have a therapist, sometimes that don't always work. For some men, it works for me. But for some men, that does not work. So you have to have a bulletproof mindset with life. You can't just have a kid. and You can't be fucked up in life and think, oh, I'm going to have a kid and then I have a reason to live. No, the fuck you won't because what if that kid grow up and they hate your ass? Then you feel like a failure. Then you feel more fucked up than you was in the beginning. What if you get married and I'm going to get a wife so I don't be so lonely? The bitch hates you. She don't even want to fuck you at night. Then what you going to do? You going to kill yourself or you going to develop a bulletproof mindset before you had a wife and the kids so nothing can affect you? Nothing can affect you. Ain't shit on this world can happen that will affect you because you could bounce back from anything. Resiliency. You need to always be resilient because shit going to happen. Life going to happen. Life is always going to happen. Life stops for nobody. Just because you're having a bad day, just because your grandma died, just because your mom died, your dad died, life don't stop for that. It's a time to grieve always. Don't ever try to hold it in. Don't be afraid to cry either. Because real men cry. Real men let that shit out. You ain't got to do it in front of the whole world. But look, it's always outlets out there to talk to people. But you need to develop a bulletproof mindset to where you don't need no fucking body. You got all the shit for you. Everything you need, every answer you need for anything is within you. I promise you it is. It's within you. I promise. And if you believe in a higher power, pray about it. But you can't be moving through life with this soft ass mindset like, oh, peaches and cream, mommy, mommy, daddy, daddy. No, ain't no mommy, mommy, daddy, daddy. When you turned 18, that shit stopped. That shit stopped. That shit was long gone. You can't be jumping into these relationships, into these jobs, into this, uh, into these schools and these colleges and thinking people finna give you uh, love like your mom and dad did. And some of y'all didn't even get love from the mom and dad. Just keep it in the hundred. You can't be jumping into these colleges and going to football camps and you get cut. You acting like a bitch after. That's life, man. You got to develop the mindset where I don't give a fuck. I'm finna give it my all. If it don't work out, fuck it. It's a wrap. I'm going to go to the next team and I'm going to shit on y'all. You have to have this mindset going through life. You have to be the guy that don't give a fuck. You unfazed at everything. Because if you're not, the shit is going to fuck you up. The whole life will fuck you up. You always heard that saying, don't let life not take your smile away. The life will take your whole fucking smile, your face, your eyes, everything away. Because if the shit you're dealing with now is fucked up, wait till you get... Older, and you got the wife, the kids, the mortgage, the car payments. What you think you're going to do then? Lose your job. Oh, I can't make this payment no more. Nigga, don't let it phase you. Go find more. Go be better. Nigga, be that provider you said you was going to be. Bulletproof mindset. Can't shit phase you. Can't shit phase you. I need you to jump into this mindset right now. In 2024 and on, you need to have this mindset. Bulletproof mindset. Can't nothing phase you. Can't nothing hold you back. Can't nothing get in your way. Ain't nothing going to stop you from getting what you want. Nothing. Not a relationship. Not a job. Not a car. Not my tat tire going flat. Not my oh my insurance not paid. Not my, my rent can't make it. Not my, my mom died. My dad died. My dog died. It don't fucking matter because guess what? Life going to keep going. You knew that shit was going to happen. You knew that shit was going to happen eventually. Mourn it and continue. Continue to be the best you. It's going to take some time. I'm very empathetic. I understand. Mom dying, dad dying, that's very traumatic. But you need to have the mindset. You can't be having the mindset. You can take a couple months even to revamp. But if you got kids, a wife, mom and dad died. Kids still got to eat. Wife still need that protection. You the man of the house. You need to be there. You, you need this mindset like, I'm stoic. Can't nothing get in my way. Can't nothing stop me from doing what I want to do. Can't nothing 
Can't nothing stop this train. The only time your train need to be stopped is when you die. That's when you can mourn. That's when you can stop everything you're doing. That's when you could give up. That's when you could quit. And even then, you can't even quit. Fuck you quitting for it. Now it's time for your ghost to do the dance. Hey, man, the mind is a terrible thing to waste, and you need to have a bulletproof mindset. You don't need nobody. All the answers is within you. Everything that you want to do in this life, the answers are within you. You don't need nobody's validation. You don't need nobody's approval. You don't need nobody's companionship. None, none of that. You need to go within and find out who you are even before you do any of that. That's the video for the day, man. Y'all boys keep a bulletproof mindset at all times. When you wake up tomorrow morning, just be ready for some fuck shit to happen. Always think positive, but be ready for some fuck shit to happen. Because when it happens, what you going to do? Oh, fuck. My boss didn't tell me. To... Fuck that. Yo, okay. He told me to do this. I'm finna get right. I'm finna get active. I'm finna kill this shit. He thought this shit was something. I'm finna kill it. Watch. He thought this shit was going to take me all day. I'm finna knock it out in 30 minutes. Then I'm finna go do a whole workout. Or he thought, my boss thought this shit was gonna, you know what I'm saying, get in my way, hold me back. My boss thought keeping me past the work hours was gonna hold me back. I'm finna do this shit, go to the gym, and then come in before him tomorrow. And then I'm gonna ask him, hey, what you eat for dinner last night? This the mindset you gotta have to make it as a man in life. You gotta think, you the fucking shit. I don't give a fuck. You got the strongest mindset in the world. That's how you need to think. Ain't no bitch shit. Because then when you have kids, you want them to have the same mindset, especially if you have sons. Because one day you're not going to be here. And then you want your sons to be like, I can't do this. My boss is bullying me. No. You want your sons to be thinking just like this because life is not easy for nobody. And as a man, you need to realize this shit is never going to be easy. It wasn't designed to be easy for us. And you got to get out here and make something of yourself. That's all I got for y'all today, man. TC signing out. But as y'all know, man, I'm going to be back, though. Y'all just make sure y'all ready, man. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and give a thumbs up to my shit, man. I'm out. I don't care if you're tired or if you're going through bad times right now. You need to work much harder. Nobody cares about your problems.